What's happening, humanoids? It's another good day for GTA. So as many of my subs will know, I was away from posting for a good month or so. Sadly, this is because I did in fact get diagnosed with a massive dose of awesomeness. So I had to quarantine for a while because awesomeness can be infectious. Feel free to abuse me for that in the comments. So what's the point of this video? Well, I'm gonna show you. So a lot of you may have traded cars in the past, like this one here, for example which has got an awesome rare paint job on it. But look at those disgusting but ugly wheels. I mean, who would put a set of gold dogs or whatever they are on that? I mean, come on now. If you're a car trader, always be aware of gold wheels. Very often they are covering up with scratches because they are selected wheel colors. But if you put those on there, it stops you actually checking. So be aware of that if you are a trader. So we're going to keep our super awesome paint, we're going to get rid of the butt ugly wheels and we're going to get all that put back on this vehicle looking classy like it should have done in the start. So hit right d-pad people, take this one into the workshop and now we're going to need to purchase any one item on this car. So I just do that with the armour at the top, pay for none, go back to 100% and all we're going to do then is scroll down to a respray. And we're going to hit the respray option, we're going to select primary or secondary then we're gonna hit crew, and then we're gonna hover over the option to purchase this, do not pay for it. Now simply hit your Xbox dashboard button, your home button, or your PlayStation dashboard home button, and then press it for a second time to put you back in the game, and then simply hit Y or triangle to get out of the vehicle. Right now, in order to change the wheels, obviously we're gonna to have to merge this onto a Benny's vehicle, or an F1 vehicle, depending what wheels you wanna end up on that car. Now I actually want to select a different set of Benny's wheels for it, so I'm going to merge onto this here, the Buccaneer Custom, which is a Benny's vehicle, which means I'll have full access to all of the Benny's wheels. So jump in, hit the accelerator or hit the gas, take this one outside and we will have completed the first stage of this merge. Don't forget to drop a like, drop your panties, share it with your grand, subscribe and all that good stuff. Okay, so here we are now with that super awesome paint job pushed onto this Buccaneer Custom. So all I have to do is get out of this one, it will disappear. That means it has gone back inside the arena to its parking space. So all we need to do now is go in and apply the fix to this one, ready to merge back onto the original vehicle. So if this was a car that you were traded guys, this is your perfect opportunity now to see if those wheels really are unselected, unscratched or if they are in fact scratched and they were just hidden with a gold wheel choice. So now we need to go over to our Buccaneer Custom. Obviously you could do this with any Benny vehicle and if it was F1 wheels that you were trying to apply then you could do this obviously to an F1 car or any other vehicle that you have with F1 wheels. So jump in the Buccaneer, hit right D-pad and take this one into the vehicle workshop. This is where we will fix the wheels, pick the ones that we want before we remerge this back to the original vehicle. Don't forget to say hello to the techno loving mofo on your way in. So go straight to the wheel section guys and simply click and just you need to choose whichever wheels which you want to put onto this vehicle. Again if you want to check if these wheels were scratched this is where you can go to the wheel colour and you can actually see if they were really selected or unselected. So once you have chosen your wheels, all you need to do is go to the respray option if you're using that option or the neon light option if you already had a crew color on your car. And we're going to highlight the crew option, we're going to sit over that option again and then we're going to hit the PlayStation home button or the Xbox dashboard button, then just hit it for a second time and simply get out of the car once you're back into the game. So now we can go back to the original car which had the dirty yucky wheels on it and we can get in this and again all you need to do is hit the accelerator, hit the gas, drive this one outside and those changes will take place. So there you go guys, you've just seen that little change take place and there you go, we now have these decent cherry coloured unselected wheels to go with that paint job instead of those uh, disgusting gold ones. Why would anyone put gold wheels on there when you had unselected cherry wheels? Madness. So we're just going to take that back in now and we're going to run through this again, but this time we're going to try it with F1 wheels. Um, my second character I'm playing on now doesn't have much F1 wheels on anything really, so we're going to mix it up, see if the F1 wheels look better on here than the Benny Lick Licks. So similar process guys, or basically the same process with different vehicle. 
So we're going to use this one as our donor again, as it has uh, the nice coloured wheels unselected, the nice coloured paint. But we're going to see what it looks like on F1. So I've got my F1 car there, so that is what we're going to be merging it onto. I have no idea why I'm running over and pointing at the Buccaneer. As you can tell, I voice these over afterwards. <laughs> so who knows what I was doing right there. So, okay, we need to push this onto the F1 car this time, guys. It's that simple. So, just jump in this one, hit right D-pad, take it into the workshop. And like before, we're just going to buy any one item on this vehicle. It does not matter what it is. And then we're going to scroll down to that respray or neon light option. We're going to select crew. We're going to sit over the option to pay for the crew choice. And then we're going to hit either the PlayStation Home button, the Xbox Dashboard button, and then we're going to hit it for a second time. And then either hit X or Y to... Uh, get out of X or Y, X or, fuck me, Y or triangle to get out of the car. God damn, my brain just melted on me. So when your brain unmelts, just go over and jump into the F1 car, hit the accelerator, hit the gas, take this one outside, and the first part of the merge is done. Now I like how the bodywork always disappears when you first bring the F1 cars out. Just a shame that there's not a way to actually make them stick like that without any of the fairing on. That would be a that'd be a cool little modification. So once you're outside, guys, you know what to do. Just jump out, head back inside, and then we can get on with the next stage of this merge. So now we have our unscratched awesome paint job on the F1 car. We have our unscratched wheel color, but we have Benny wheels on our F1. So hit right D-pad, take this one into the vehicle workshop. Say hello to the techno loving mofo on the way. So this time you're going to go down to wheels and you are going to select any set of wheels. It can be obviously anything apart from the stock wheels. If you are using F1 cars to transfer F1 wheels, make sure you change the wheels from stock to any other variation. Because if you have stock wheels selected, all you'll do is put stock wheels onto the other merged vehicle, stock for stock. That's how it works, guys. So once you've made your wheel choice, you can just, oh, and make your tire choice now as well if you like to. Uh, but then you can go down to the respray or the neon light option and we're gonna do the same thing again. Select primary or secondary, select crew, highlight the crew color option, and then hit your PlayStation home button, your Xbox dashboard button, hit it second time, press triangle or Y to get out of your vehicle, and then go back to the car which you were trying to put these onto. And once outside, you will see the magic happen. Okay guys, so there you go. Now we have the F1 version of this with clean paint, unscratched wheel color, Yanktons, green tints, all of that good stuff. And yeah, that's how you do it. So as you know, Benny's merge has not worked for quite a long time. So if you've been out trading over the last few months, chances are you've picked up some of these uh, cars with ugly wheels that you would like to change so this is the perfect opportunity we don't know how long this merge is going to last so i would seriously take advantage of this and get all your car modifications done while it's still here okay guys i think that's us done for this video hopefully that was helpful for some of you get out there and start fixing those ugly wheels on your nice cars beautiful paint jobs Thanks for watching guys, don't forget to drop a like, drop your panties, share it with your grand, subscribe and all that good stuff. And as always, take it easy humans.